Hey everybody, happy Sunday. Um, we are just coming to you guys live from cool California and we thought we would jump on here this afternoon and introduce ourselves to you. We have had a lot of new people, a lot of new followers, a lot of new friend requests this week, which thank you guys. We appreciate um, you sending us friend requests and following us and um, thanking or trusting us on your keto journey. Sorry, I was trying to tag Mark in the video. Trusting us on your keto journey. So as you guys are coming on, if you could say hello and um, drop live in the comments, let us know where you are watching from. If you're catching a replay, hashtag replay. And also, if you guys could share this out, share this with family members and friends that you know that are looking for better. Um, we really appreciate that. Uh, we've added over 100 people this week to our secret group, which is just amazing. That way we can help them to find their better too. If you guys want in that secret group, drop secret in there. Hi Pam, thank you for saying hello from Oregon. You guys, we really appreciate you saying hello. So, who are we? Well, I'm Renee. I'm Mark. <laughs> Hashtag Team Terry. So we've been uh, married for 23 years. Um, We've had uh, our ups and downs uh, as far as our weight loss and, and different medical issues and whatnot. Um, I worked a very uh, physical job uh, earlier in my career and uh, didn't have any problems with, with my weight. Uh, and then after a second knee surgery, was told I couldn't go back to that physical job uh, and found a, a job in an office, which over the course of the next 17 years or so put about 60 pounds on me. Those people bring a lot of snacks and stuff. Yeah, <laughs> office jobs are yes. the worst for snacks and whatnot. I had several uh, several jobs that they would bring the snacks in our area. So anyway, uh, tried every diet you could think of. Um, tried the HCG diet. I tried and lost weight, um, but then just seemed to stall and lose it my losses would become bigger gains. So if you've uh, been on that roller coaster, drop a yo-yo in the comments. You guys, I mean, it, it's totally, it's relatable. You you diet, it's just like a hose. You kink it off and you like lose, lose, lose. But as soon as you stop um, and unleash the hose, you gain it all back. So you guys drop yo-yo in the comment if that's you too. Um, where are we going? Okay, so how we found this? Yeah. So yeah, how we found this, you guys, I made notes so we could try to remember. So um, back in, uh, let's see, Labor Day of 2018, I got an infection in my tooth and um, I had a really hard time with this infection. I ended up going from dentist to dentist to dentist. It was 17, I believe. Yeah. Was it 2017? Yeah. Okay, maybe, yeah. I'm, I'm terrible with dates, ask him, <laughs> numbers, math, anything like that. But anyway, I went from doctor to doctor, dentist to dentist to dentist, and ended up having a surgery because I had an infection in my tooth. I ended up having them removed. Um, but through all of that, I was on antibiotics and steroids that put me into a total and absolute brain fog. So if this is relatable to anybody, drop relatable in the comments. Um, if it's relatable that whenever you go to a doctor or a dentist for an ailment, it seems like they give you stuff which turns into another ailment that turns into another ailment. And that's just about where we were. Um, after we got all of my dental stuff done, I was in this brain fog that I couldn't get rid of. And so I asked the doctor, how do I get rid of my brain fog? And he said, you know, you need to do an anti-inflammatory diet. And I never had heard the term anti-inflammatory diet, so I Googled it and I came up with keto. So I tried it. I tried it on my own. It wasn't that I was dieting. I was just trying to get into ketosis to get rid of my brain fog. And you guys, I sucked at it. I really did. I sucked. I love tortillas. I love bread. Um, I wasn't really overweight. So to starve myself for three days to try to get into a ketosis, I failed every time. And you know, I was kind of like, okay, this isn't for me. I saw a girlfriend that was doing the keto or was getting into ketosis and she was losing weight. Hi Denise, thank you for saying hello you guys as you come on. Um, and I asked her what she was doing and she said she was taking um, exogenous ketones. And I'm like, what is this? Tell me more, I need some. Because if you can have a drink that within 55 minutes you can get into ketosis, instead of having to starve yourself for a week to do it, I was like all in. So 
I talked to Mark about it and told him what I was going to do, and he's about that time I think you were getting ready to do the HC diet. I was going to do another round with HCG, and it uh, I wasn't really looking forward to it. I wasn't really motivated to to lose the weight, but I just, at that point I was still 230 pounds and miserable, um, joints aching, just short of breath, just felt terrible. So um, when she started, she started talking about the ketosis and the keto diet. That was my cue to uh, start Googling it and, and uh, looking at how to do this um, through our diet. Um, I like to cook. I, I've always enjoyed cooking. Um, due to our uh, uh, job situations for a while, I took over all the cooking. Um, he keeps it now because he's better now that's at it. Still, yeah. I don't like to clean up, so it's a lot easier for me to do the cooking. <laughs> yeah. um, but that's, we got started on it and we have just found a ton of things that uh, are so enjoyable to eat and, and yet keeping you in ketosis and losing fat, mm -hmm. um, losing weight, you're, you're, you just, you feel better, your joints don't hurt, you're, you're able to get up and move around better. Yes. If you guys like to cook, hit love, put love to cook in the comments and if you love to eat, it, but lo, drop love to eat in the comments. So about that time, um, Mark had just had like a physical too at the beginning of July, and blood pressure, cholesterol, all of that stuff. Um, doctor says you got about None six months. You got about six months till we look at putting you on medication. So, like I said, both of us, two different reasons. Me, the mental clarity, the energy, the brain fog. I was doing two five-hour energies a day, coffee, and I just couldn't focus. Everything was so difficult to focus on. And Mark, he needed to get his blood pressure down, his cholesterol in line, and he needed to lose some weight. So we found the ketones, and you guys, life has been wonderful. wonderful. Yeah. I mean, we have keto, ketones. Um, it's just been amazing. So we had to share. So this is kind of how we got to where we are right now. Um, I started sharing with my family, my friends, um, my cousins. I'm gonna show you some of my cousins. Um, so, okay, first of all, this is Paws. And you can see how much weight she's lost. This is an old picture too, so. Um, but this she's is my, lost more. yeah, this is my cousin Andra, and she dropped 25 pounds. Now with Andra, it wasn't just the weight loss, her too. It was like, I have the energy to um, run around with my kids, to play volleyball. She goes, I am in such a good mood all the time. You know, it was like, wow, this is awesome. So we had to keep sharing. This is my other cousin. He is down 51 pounds and same thing. Like he said, I used to be tired all, all the, the time. time. I didn't have the energy and now he does. He goes, I feel like Superman and it's like, which this is Batman, by the way. Um, I feel like he super <laughs> Hey, if you guys know a superhero, drop the word superhero in um, the comments for us. So um, basically, we started sharing with all of our family, all of our friends. I could keep going on. This is Christy, um, my other friend Christy, um, a coworker, Dennis. I mean everybody that we shared with was absolutely loving it so it's like how do we share more how do we support them so with the Facebook um, oh, I can't think of what I'm trying platform. to think platform thank you with the Facebook platform we were able to come on and talk to a bunch of people tell them what we were doing update them on our journey and so that worked out good and all we ask is that they share it out which we will ask you guys to share this with your family and friends share this in your book club share this with your um, soccer moms share this because it's amazing this is so different than what we were ever taught we were always taught you know protein um, carbs for fuel never high fat moderate protein low carbs and no sugar it was just so different so I'm like just share it out that's all we asked well what happened was they couldn't share it with people we weren't friends with so we started going public um, and with my mom and my aunts they were always what are you guys making what are you cooking well Mark was doing all the work at finding adaptable keto recipes that I talked him into it <laughs> doing um, keto kitchens and so that's kind of how we got here so you guys now know who we are how we got here and what we do but we want to share with you guys just for I'm sure a lot of you do know keto and ketosis so first of all what's ketosis ketosis is when your body burns fat for fuel 
And you guys, it's amazing. You can have two sources of fuel, glucose and ketones. So fat and sugar. So um, you can get into ketosis through nutritional. I know a lot of people do. You have to be very, very strict. You've got to watch every label. Um, you have to, it takes like four to six days to get into ketosis. Um, but then all it takes is just one, one mistake. Yeah, not getting a good night's sleep. Yeah, stress at work could be anything. Yeah, um, not reading a label. And you're back, yeah, you, you miss an ingredient in a label and and it throws you out of ketosis and now you're working three to four, six days, whatever, to get back into ketosis. Well, that's where our drinks come in. Yeah. Um, our drinks get us into ketosis within an hour and keep us there five to six hours. Mm -hmm. um, so you're burning, you're burning fat for fuel, which gives you more energy. It's, you're getting rid of the carbohydrates that your body doesn't need. It's, carbohydrates produce the, or, or promote the inflammation and the, yes. the aching and the, you just, the brain fog, all of it. So Google it, you guys. <clears throat> Google keto and ketosis with your ailment. Whatever's bothering you, like Linda said, there's lots of hidden ingredients that are bad for you. Yeah. Absolutely. But Google it. Google um, th what the benefits are, and you guys will see why it is so amazing. And like Mark talked about earlier, our lives are kind of crazy. We both work full time. We yeah. both commute. We don't always get our full sleep. Um, no. We're not always reading the ingredients. Sometimes we cheat a little. We're a little lazy. <laughs> um, but we're still losing. I'm still losing weight. Mm -hmm. uh, she's still got her, her, her clarity, yes. uh, her mood. Her, her beauty. Aww. All... <laughs> yeah, if you guys so. like if you guys like it when you're in a good mood, drop mood in the comments because I know Mark likes it when I'm in a good mood and yes. these keep me in a good mood, especially whenever he tells me I'm beautiful. I love you, honey. So. so anyway, we want to tell you guys a little bit about these drinks. Like I said, these are our insurance policy. So basically like last night we both got a good night's sleep. We actually slept in until like nine o'clock this yeah, morning. We were tired. Kind of shocking. So. But usually we get like five to six hours sleep, which throws us right out of ketosis. But with these drinks, you shake them up with water, and within 59 minutes, you are in ketosis. You guys, thank you so much for everybody who is saying hello. We really appreciate you. Um, thank you, guys. Like I said, if you're watching live, let us know where you're coming from. Mark is going to go over the flavors of these drinks. If you guys want to try these, drop trial in the comments, and we we'll can get, get you a trial. We'll get you hooked up here. So this uh, first one is uh, um, raspberry lemonade, which is pretty self-explanatory. It's really, really good. Um, these are all nat formulas, which are uh, naturally fermented ketones. Um, and it's, I haven't found one I didn't like. I mean, there's my favorites, of course, but um, the next one is a Maui punch, which looks like a, uh, it tastes like a, a fruit punch. Um, that's, a, that's a really popular one. These are our these are our uh, staple flavors that you can get it all the time. This one's lime time. It's like a limeade. Um, it's very good. And this is one of my favorites, um, the heart tart. Mm -hmm. This one tastes uh, kind of like strawberry. You know, sweet tart. Sweet tart. Yeah. yeah. It's got and a little bite it. to it, but it's it. just really really good. Um, the splash is kind of like a watermelon citrus type mm. flavor. This is another one of my favorites. It's really, really good. And then uh, for chocolate lovers, there's the Swiss cacao. We um, have friends that put that in their coffee are, in the morning. Yes, you can put it in your coffee. You can mix it with a little heavy cream and make like a little chocolate milk type thing in the morning. It's it's very, a lot of these are very versatile. And then we've got some... Uh, um, seasonal type. Um, these are our summer flavors. Yeah, these are summer flavors. This first one's called True Passion. It's uh, like a mango uh, flavor. These, um, it's, I, oh, I don't good. drink, but I've been told these work real good in rum I or do vodka. Drink. I do uh, drink, and they do work really well. It gets the caffeine free. Yes, yeah. amazing. This, this one, next one is a mint chip cream. If you like uh, mint chocolate chip ice cream, this, this is your drink right here. Milkshakes. This stuff is milkshake. You can put it in milkshakes. We actually have one where we've got in the freezer right now. We're doing for an ice cream um, with. Uh, you guys some... drop 15 pack in the comments, and you will get one of each of these flavors. So drop 15 so pack, you and you will all. get be able to get um, the trial with all these flavors. So the next one is a. Uh, it's called Life's a Peach. 
It is a like a peach tea, uh, like a Snapple type uh, peach tea. This one's really good also. Um, and then we've got some other. Uh, these are kind of a winter thing, but they're you can get them now. Um, this one's called Fairy Dust. It's like a sugar plum uh, uh, flavor. It's really good uh, it's, hot. It's yeah, I I drink it hot or cold. Uh, I think I kind of prefer it hot. Um, it's just kind of a warm and cuddly type uh, feeling. Um, and then the last one is Celebration, which this one is like a pear apple type. It's like Martinelli sparkling cider. Yeah, if you put it in like a carbonated. Oh, yeah, if you could put so it in some uh, seltzer water. Um, really? It would be a carbonated type. Yeah, very good. Almost like a, a champagne type um, flavor. And then really good. Some of the other things that we do for you guys that are keto, because I know we have a lot of new people that are keto and you guys are staying in ketosis, losing it on your own without using the exogenous ketones. But if you are drinking that coffee, you know, the greasy coffee that you get all over your lips, we have these to put in your coffee to where you don't have to make that up anymore. You don't have to put MCT or butter in your coffee to make that coffee that you drink. These are creams. And these have four types of collagen and three types of MCT oils in them. And it has your DNA repair. So my skin, my hair, my nails, all of this is in a delicious drink that I put in my coffee. Mark puts in his tea every morning that help you to create exogenous ketones or endogenous, I'm sorry. So those are exogenous ketones. You drink those, they put you in ketosis within 55 minutes, keep you there for four to six hours, depending on your body and your diet. These are endogenous ketones. These help you to make your own. So we have three flavors of these. We have um, the sweet cream, the mocha Mayan, which is like a um, spicy Mexican hot chocolate. Oh, I like it. A girl the other day said it burned her throat though, so I guess you have to like spicy. I like this one. And then we have pumpkin spice. If you guys would like to get a cream trial, dry drop cream in the comments and I can get those for you and you won't have to mix up all that stuff in your coffee and have like gooey lips or whatever make a mess so if you want a cream trial we have these also we both start our days off with these gives you your functional fat your collagen which is good for your knees your hips your nails your skin make your husband tell you you're beautiful yeah, to just get some bonus points. And then also we have a few other ones for some of you that are already doing them. We've got the Unleashed. These are amazing for like pre-workout. And we have an, un you can get ask us for an Unleashed trial too. So drop Unleashed. These have 33% um, more ketones than the NAP and then more caffeine. So for those of you who just need um, a total kickstart, I work um, Storm and sometimes really long days. So whenever you're pulling a 16 hour day and then you get up with three hours sleep the next day, you drink one of these and oh my goodness. It's really just, good for focus Yeah, you um, just and energy. Right back at us. We've got three different flavors of these that we have all three flavors that you can get them in. We've got the Blue Ocean, which is Mark's favorite. That's a pina colada type uh, flavor. It's mm -hmm. really good. And then we have the um, Eclipse, which is my favorite. If you watch my stories, this is what I have almost every morning. This is like a black cherry. Um, Cherry Coke type, yeah. Yeah, and then Ruby Rush, which is probably more my favorite, not as much Mark's. If you like grapefruit, this is absolutely amazing. It's a grapefruit. Um, but this one's really good too. So we've showed you guys all of the flavors, kind of told you guys a little bit about us. Um, so you guys just know a little more. We kind of tried to get to know you as we've been adding you guys to the groups and you all inspire us. I mean, so inspiring. I had a guy this morning that messaged and he was asking some questions and I got him added to our, our group. Oh, speaking of that, if you guys want to get added to the group that we've been adding people to all week long that has recipes, support, info on the ketones, put secret um, in the comments and we will get you added we'll get to you that. Added. But he messaged this morning, it was so awesome. He just said, yeah, my wife has been struggling to lose weight, so I wanna do what you guys are doing. He goes, I'm looking for inspiration as far as for meal prep to support her and help her. That just inspires us to know that we can actually help other people to you know, just live their better lives. That's why we do what we do. Um, that's why Mark goes on and does the Keto Kitchen so people can see that this food is actually really good. It's really good. good. I haven't, yeah. It's just amazing. I mean, um, you can you can still get a lot of spice if you like spicy, mm -hmm. a lot of flavor, and you're. We don't feel like we're missing out on anything. No. Yeah, I'm sure Renee misses her bread a little bit, but okay. yeah, um, just a little something. But he makes a wonderful biscuits and gravy whenever I'm wanting, or he makes me a French toast. Um, yes, he's awesome. He makes anything that I'm like 
craving. You're amazing. Mm -hmm. And then Mark, he's always got the sweet tooth. And so always. how do I've you get your high fats, forever. you know, and crave your curb your sweet tooth? It's fat bombs. That's why he's so good at fat bombs. Um, and we're, our freezer's always full of them. So you guys, follow us um, for all things keto. Just all you have to do is tap my nose, hit the three dots up at the top, scroll down, hit follow, and then see our stuff, see our stuff first. That way you'll be notified whenever we go live. Like tonight, we're going to go live and we're going to show you how to make pizza. And it's chicken crust. Yep, it's not fat dough or it's, fat head, yeah, which it's everybody does. not fat head dough. We this like is the a, chicken, this is crust. A chicken crust. It's so, so it's good, really you guys. Good. So we're going to show you how to do that tonight at six, uh, five o'clock. I think we're going to have dinner. Yeah, so I'll post. Um, but anyway, so follow us and then send us a friend request too. Like I said, so we can get to know you. Um, like my girlfriend on here always says, you're human, we're human. That's what we should do. We should get to know each other and help each other to be better humans. Wouldn't help that make, you find you better. Wouldn't that make an amazing world? So we really appreciate you guys coming on here and sharing um, some of your time with us. Your time is precious. We also appreciate you guys sharing this out with your friends and loved ones so that they can find out the better. This is so much different than what we've always been told. Remember, high fat, moderate protein, low carbs. Total opposite of what we were told as far as how to be healthy. Um, and so we'd like to just make sure that everybody knows about it. If you got value from this, give this a quick like and a, sh a quick like and a share out and drop the word value in the comments. We appreciate you guys. We love you all, and we will see you tonight. About 5 o'clock. About 5 o'clock for chicken crust pizza. Oh, my gosh. It's going to be its amazing, you guys. You're going to love it. So we'll see you then. Bye, y'all. Bye.